they're calling him the Oppenheimer of comedy. Oh, mate, that's credible. Actually, before we go back to Matt Rife, I'm actually going to, I want to I wanna rewatch the first five minutes of Gringo Pappy because I'm convinced Brendan Schaub is better than Matt Rife. That's my hot take of the day. Brendan Schaub is better than Matt Rife. I don't care what you guys say, but I'm convinced he's better. Brendan Schaub, Gringo Pappy, because this Matt Rife thing has been flipping crazy. Gringo <laughs> Pappy. I'm going to watch the first five minutes because that first 15 minutes we watched from Matt Rife, I didn't find it funny at all in the slightest. So I'm going to watch the first five with my tissue. I should be getting the tissue first. Look how much I watched of it. I actually watched quite a lot of it when it first came out, didn't I? Look at that. Look at that. That's a real, that's a real fan. Look at that. I watched quite a bit of it, didn't I? Let's see. But let's see the first five minutes of it compared to him because I've got a feeling this guy, this kid's kind of overrated. He's got timestamps on his comedy special. Okay, cool. Let's go to the front. Let's go to the first five. Bra Ted, man. He did a 25 minute comedy special and there's an intro of one minute. So essentially it was 24 minutes comedy special. Cool. Let's see this. First five minutes of Gringo Pappy. Let's see how that compares to um, Matt Rife's special. Because I've got a feeling these guys are on the same sort of level. Where's Matt Rife's like? Where is he? Uh, no, no, he's up there. Is that him there? Nope. Nope, nope. I think he's over here, right? Wait, there we go. Matt Rife. Cool. Let's bring him over here. Let's have him in the same spot. Boom, bang, boom. It's there, isn't it? Boom, let's go over here. Okay, so Matt Rife is there. Gringo Pappy is there. Let's see. It's about five minutes. I bet you it's better. I think some of you guys misremembered how brilliant this fucking special was. Let's see this. Come on, Brendan. Remind them of your greatness. Remind them. Remind them. <laughs> see? First joke. Killer already. Killer already. <laughs> Dicey, dicey. First joke, smash it already. <laughs> Look how happy he is. <laughs> it's even better that we know now that, according to according to BGL, now we know this is the really crazy part of it. According to BGL, on that interview that he did, I think with um the guy from MMA Holes, I think it was that. But BGL said something, or maybe it was on the subreddit. He said that Brendan thought this special was going to be the one that was going to send him to the stratosphere. This was the one that was going to finally get him to do theatres and stuff. That's how delusional that man is. He legitimately thought that Gringo Pappy was his meal ticket, like, you know, to flipping stardom. Like, he was going to be undeniable now when the Gringo Pappy came out. That's what makes a Gringo Pappy even way funnier than what it actually is. The fact that he was that delusional. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's play this. I love you, Texas. That's how it is. I love it. I love it. There's always one guy. No fucking way, bro! <laughs> that needle's not touching this fucking temple, daddy. <laughs> as he says, as he's taking a nacho, dipping in nacho cheese. From... <laughs> oh, my bad, Mr. Whole Foods. My bad. <laughs> do man I was... this whole vaccination stuff I'm not anti-vax man I'm vaccinated but it's uh, it's all in their marketing they fucked this whole thing up in their marketing without Operation Warp Speed when they launched mm. that remember they're trying to get everybody to get vaccinated and they're like yeah go to Krispy Kreme buy a dozen donuts get vaccinated like the fuck that makes sense <laughs> fat people are like hell yeah fuck this <laughs> <laughs> It's so confusing. I remember I called my mom. I was like, hey, mama, are you, uh, are you getting vaccinated? She's all, I wasn't. And then, you know, I love donuts. You recorded donuts, this. So like, oh, shit. <laughs> you thought this was a comedy special. I can't believe this, man. Do you remember the first legend. dumbass that messed it all up for everybody? Scared the shit out oh, of Jesus from getting legend. vaccinated. I remember that idiot? He's all over the news stations. The first moron to get that Johnson & Johnson. Right? Clearly a meth addict. They just... <laughs> Nobody checked into his background. Remember that? They put him on the news. He's sweaty as shit. He was on all the major broadcasts. He's like, holy shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, I got it done. I got that Johnson Johnson, bro. I don't feel good, bro. I can't stop sweating, bro. I feel like I'm growing wings. Bro. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna lay low for a little bit on the vaccination. I'm just gonna. Remember that moron? It's all in marketing, man. Like they need to hire some just a dime piece actor we've never heard of. Just blast them all over the news, right? Just somebody who's fine. Get them on there. And just put them all over the news, all over the nation. Like, I, yeah, dude, I got the Johnson Johnson. I feel pretty good. I feel great, actually. If I'm being honest, one side effect. If I'm, I just want to be up front with everybody. Goddamn dick's down to here. <laughs> just <fucking. laughs> You'd have a line of bros at CVS just like... <laughs> just trying to do my part, man. Just <laughs> <laughs> Five minutes in it's yet? It's good to be in Dallas, man. Three you guys minutes. do it right. Okay, two it's minutes good left. to be in Dallas. I know. Two minutes left. Yeah. Yeah. Two minutes left. There's a reason I decided to shoot my special here, man. You guys just give me so much love. I absolutely love Texas, man. I, uh, yeah. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. I, uh, I haven't touched a mask since I touched down. It is fantastic. <laughs> LA um, is not like this, y'all. A what? A mask? Did you say a mask or mask? Mask? What was that? Yeah, thank you. Thank you. I, uh, I haven't touched a mask since I touched down. Jesus Christ, Brendan Shaw. Mask. Mass. It is fantastic. <laughs> L.A. is not like this, y'all. L.A. is North Korea with a beach. It is like... <laughs> but they give us Wi-Fi, so that's cool. They're talking about locking us back down. I can't go through another lockdown. Straight up, my, the shop household barely made it through the last one. We eat our way out of that last one. We did not do well with it. Also, Dallas, my lockdown's different. I got a five-year-old and two-year-old. Parents know what I'm talking about. I would rather do anything else than be locked down with those fucking demons 24-7. <laughs> we're not even locked down. My girl was fighting with me the other week. If we get locked down, we're fucked. She was fighting with me. Fighting, nye, 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 fouty, nye, nye. Why is she speak? Why is she? Why is she speaking so fast? The lack of breaths and pausing and the, it's the, the pace is so frenetic. Like, I wonder if this was Baddies and Addies time. Do you reckon this is BGL's fault? Do you reckon this is BGL's fault? Do we have BGL to blame for this? BGL was the one that was lacing his drinks with Addies. So he was just like, Rah. he can't pronounce words anyway. Then he's rushing. And he's probably nervous because he's recording his comedy special. That's meant to be half an hour. That's actually 24 minutes and 21 seconds long when you take out the intro. <laughs> God almighty, man. Take a breath, brother. Delta, mass. What are we going to do? i see myself. Oh, my God. My life would be so much easier if I was just gay as shit. <laughs> If I was locked down with the bros, Dallas? One more minute. Quarantine with the homies? You know how much more fun we would have? Oh my God, dude. We'd like play video games all day. We'd work out. At night, we'd fuck each other. <laughs> <laughs> this guy was all, what the fuck? No. I, I thought we were gonna play video games, bro. <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> I love that. No, fuck no, I'm not into that, dude. I'm not. I don't want to be locked down with you anymore. I just. <laughs> Let's be honest now. Five minutes has gone by. How much funnier is Matt Reif than Brendan Schaub? Take away your bias, right? Take away your bias. Take away your bias. I'm actually gonna put. I'm actually gonna do a poll here because I think some of you guys are lying because that Matt Reif guy isn't funny. I don't care what anyone says here. Um. Uh. Let's see. Um, if you so yeah, uh, if you had to watch the last, no, is it? Uh, if yeah, if you could only watch one, whoops, one stand-up special. <clears throat> if you can, if you can only watch one stand-up special. Who would you go for? Yeah. Who would you choose? Yeah, if you yeah, if you could only watch one. Yeah, da, 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 who would you choose? Uh, Papa or Matt Rife? Be honest, right? Be honest. 
No lies in the fucking chat. Be honest with this poll. If you could only watch one stand-up special, who would you choose? Or who would you watch? Who would you, yeah? who would you watch? Or who would, this is, who would you choose? Doesn't matter. Who would you pick? No lies, okay? I want to hear what the community says here. No lies from the community. Let's see. Baba or Matt Rife? Let me know in the poll. Do, 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 Watching, watching, watching. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> See how close it is. Look how close it is. It's 54, 47 percent. It's neck and neck. <laughs> okay, 53% for Matt Rye, 47% for Papa. Raw Ted, Brent C, I told you. We already told you. <laughs> oh my god. 